What is up, good people? It's your loved one, Candice from ThatGreenLife.com. In today's video, I want to show you all how I manually wash my clothes with the help of a few gadgets. First things first, I want to show you all the clothing rack that I picked up from Bed Bath & Beyond. This one is by Salt. It's a compact accordion dryer, but you know what? I found one on Amazon for much cheaper. You can find that in the description box below. For the soaking process, I use baking soda and white vinegar. This right here is a collapsible bucket that I also got on Amazon. You can find the link in the description box below. It's a little flimsy, but it gets the job done and it's easy to put away. Now, I'm careful not to overfill the bucket. I want to leave space for clothes cleaning efficiency. <laughs> You'll see what I mean in a moment. And now for the soaking process. Here I am adding the baking soda and the vinegar. I don't necessarily have any specific measurements as to how much vinegar and baking soda I add to the clothes, but you just know in your soul when it feels right to stop pouring. And here's the gadget that I use to wash my clothes. It's a breathable mobile washer. It's got holes at the bottom that allows you to push and pull the water through your clothes with this nice pumping action. Man, that's good pumping action. All right, y'all, this thing right here, this is the Ninja Master 6000. Okay, it's not the Ninja Master 6000. It's called the Ninja Portable Mini 3200. It's a spin dryer. It's a spin dryer by The Laundry Alternative and it holds up to about 22 pounds of wet clothes. Uh, I like it because it's super quiet and it gets my clothes damn near dry when it's done. And here I am draining my soaked clothes. I like to go in and rinse and drain about maybe two times just to get all of that baking soda and vinegar out of the mix before I add in my laundry detergent. I'm gonna go ahead and add my laundry detergent and begin the clothes washing process. Here's that nice pumping action again. Look, okay, I love, love, love this gadget. I've used it a couple times a week for the past seven months. And it's cool because it helps me get my clothes so, so, so much cleaner than a front or top load washer in my findings. And honey, the little workout that you get in the meantime is an added bonus. Now, one of the cons about having a collapsible bucket is that it actually collapses on me during the washing process so I have to be careful I like to pump my clothes for anywhere between two to five minutes and then go through as many rinse cycles necessary to assure that the water runs clear and the laundry detergent is all rinsed out here I am running my clothes under cool water while adding my homemade lavender vanilla fabric softener Here's some overhead footage of that sweet pumping action. Now it's time for the final rinse cycle. And now we're moving toward the final phase of laundry day. Here I am adding my laundry to the drum of my spin dryer. I wanna take caution as to not overfilling my spin dryer because it will not properly start. Next, I place my bucket under the spout and then I assure that all of my laundry is evenly distributed in the drum of the spin dryer. And here's my favorite part of this whole process. Something that I notice is that it's so, so, so much quieter than the spin cycle on your average washer. And look, y'all, peep this. No, literally, wash it drip. Look how much water comes out of this thing. It spins so fast that it gets all the water out of my clothes, literally down to the last drop. The end result? Damn near dry laundry. Y'all, look at that. Look. Now, sure, you can start this laundry process at night and allow your clothes to dry overnight. But let's just say one day you got somewhere to go and you got some things you got to wash to get to that place you got to go. You can start this process in the morning and then with proper ventilation, your clothes would be dry within about maybe two to three hours tops. Well, that about wraps things up for my laundry demo. Thank you all for watching. If you found this video useful, hit that like button, share and subscribe and I'll catch you all later. Peace.